What's up guys, it's Mr. Gay with 9 again, and we're gonna go check out that street crime before we go do those interrogations, because I just don't want to do those interrogations. Who knows, maybe I'll even rank up so I can use some intuition. Breathe. No, breathe, damn it! I like this music. It's like Godfather stuff. Yeah, I didn't hit one obstacle there. Oh, God. Oh, come on! Hey, I didn't know I would accidentally drive into a parking lot. Or oh, that I did idiot. know I was going to drive into. Why do you always... Recall when I'm right next to it. Just to make sure I don't forget. Car 11K, go ahead with the further. Canned fish. LAPD, stop what Ah, oh, shit. Stop what up for some of the rough stuff, are you? What's your beef with Damn this it. guy, Phelps? No. Wait, I... She's gonna get away in that truck? You! Get back here! Fuck you, Galloway. Damn it. I'll just follow him because I can't shoot his tires really. Right, this can actually sort of turn. Sort of. Now Galloway's super far behind. Jeez. Whoa, what is that over there? Is that Galloway talking who's not in the car, I might add? Well, I got him. Frank Morgan? Yeah, yeah, look, it was Harry's idea to boost the truck full of fishes, not mine. I was in the bar late talking and we say Frank hey, Morgan. You two idiots can say hello to Adrian for me. Oh, God. <laughs> Can't believe it. Got a blast from the past case. Not really a... you got to be kidding. We're <sighs> driving this? What do you mean? Oh. Yeah, it still is the L.A. County Great. Corner. How are we going to look getting around in this thing, Cole? Okay. Now, unfortunately, I'm going to go do those interrogations. Whoa there! Wait, what? Okay, I'm getting across this. Yeah, I 
plus K, I was gonna say. Easy. Is this one. Here's where we stand, Hugo. Your next door neighbor heard screaming coming from your house. You were burning your blood stained shoes. You have no one who can confirm your whereabouts last night. Your daughter says you're a violent man. We have everything we need to send you to death row. And all you have to say for yourself is I didn't do it. I swear I didn't kill her. Give me that lie test, I can prove it. You want to take a polygraph? Okay, what about, yeah, why... Why did you burn your shoes, Hugo? Because I knew you'd never believe me. Truth. Believe what? It's rabbit's blood. A guy at work brought him in and I helped him skin them. Okay, what about the rope? Do you know anything about ropes, Hugo? As much as the next man. I, I was a scout. I learned some more in the army. Intuition. Doubt. You learned to strangle with the rope in the army? With rope, with uh, my bare hands, but mainly with wire. I learned a lot of things in the army, but I, I still didn't kill my wife. For argument's sake, what type of rope would you use? If I had to, I would use a triple braid. Less flex, easier control. Victims? We found your wife's car. Someone parked it at the school late last night. Do you have anything to say about that? It wasn't me. Where do you keep your work clothes? I keep them at work in my locker. God. Truth. What color are your overalls? Green. We all wear green. It was doubt. It's a company policy. When I think they're doubtful, they're truthful, and when I think they're truthful, they're doubtful. Your wife was beaten with a tire iron, Hugo. An appropriate choice of tool for a mechanic. I know nothing about any tire iron. Bull. You're gonna die for this, Muller. <sighs> I don't believe your story. My conscience is clear. You can't badger me into admitting anything. Here we go. It's a viewing room. I gotta make in the car in the end. 
Aha. Interview room one. Oh, right. It's over here. Boys, really come through this time, haven't you? I want to make my Is that it? Come on. Captain, uh, we were on our way to interview Eli Rooney. Yes, folks, I know. This particular fiend is an old acquaintance. I have tried to reaffirm his belief in a wrathful and terrible God. Whichever way it goes, I'll be dealing personally. Okay. You look like you've had it rough. You see me asking for your sympathy, boy? You're down on your luck, Eli. I had worse. My family ate roadkill during the Dust Bowl. But you have a job. A parolee has to have a job, correct? I had me a job down in San Pedro. I'm looking for something new. Truth. What kind of job, Eli? Working for some boats, odd jobs around the boat yards. I'm pretty good with my hands. Boat yard. Boat yard. You ever tie up any of your victims, Eli? It's not a nice thing to go calling them. What would you call them? I can't say. I learned a long time ago not to go talking about the things I like. Talking about it just seems to get people's dander up. Answer the goddamn question, Rooney, before I brain you. See what I mean? Short answer is yes. You have any preference regarding rope, Eli? I know a good rope from a bad rope, if that's what you mean. That's not what you mean, is it? Any old rope will do me fine. What the hell? One boy like you, Eli, must prefer McGay for roping, am I right? I prefer braid to tie hitching braid. It stays tied. You killed Mrs. Muller and stole her jewelry. That ain't so. I ain't done nothing like that. Doubt. You have no job and nowhere to live by the smell of things. And you need money. You've been in trouble before, Eli. Who do you think a jury will believe? I've been in trouble for other things, but I ain't never killed no one. I saw that car coming to the parking lot late last night. Man got changed there and put his coveralls in the trunk. I saw him drop the butterfly in the lamplight and he strolled out, cool as you like. And I went over and I picked it up. I don't like you, Eli. I think you're an evil man. I think you try to pass off your pain to other people. I can't make you for this case. But my consolation is that I don't think you will be out of prison for very long. You can count on it, shitbird. By the way, Eli, the captain and the hat squad would like to talk to you next. Any idea what they might want to talk about? That's the guy. Detective, that's him. That's the guy who parked the car. I'm sure of it. What hey, the hell? Away. That's not true. I can't. I can't go to jail. Well, I am running low on time here. We come back, and we're gonna get this guy, put him in jail. It's been Mr. Game of Nine, Center Future Gaming, and I will see you guys next time.